Because I'm from Canada, A, eh, and we have a healthy disregard for pronouncing the letter T correctly, this is the DJI Avada. Some people say Avata, others Avata, but they're just plain weird and, well, we're moving on. Unlike normal camera drones, the Avada has a gimbal that only tilts on the vertical axis. This means you get a lot of side-to-side -side shaking and vibration if you're not using the electronic video stabilization that comes with it. While it would only make sense to use this feature while flying all the time, not all camera settings, as this brilliant and well-formatted chart clearly shows, are compatible with EIS. Although the Avada is rated to fly in up to level 5 winds, which is up to 38 kilometers an hour, or for our non-metric using friends, that comes to about 25 furlongs per fortnight, or 3 football fields per election cycle, or some such thing. If you're flying on a somewhat windy day, your non-EIS stabilized video will, well, be terrible at best. There are a number of applications you can use in post to sort this out. The one used in the following video is called Gyroflow, link in the description below, and it uses the Avada's gyroscopically logged motion data embedded in the video file to do some fancy math to smooth out your awesome footage. You then take the end result and make some further corrections as you see fit in something like Premiere Pro or some other video editing software. The video that follows is from an early spring flight in Ontario that shows first the original unedited video, the smoothed out video having used Gyroflow, then the horizon corrected in post, and finally some basic color correction that was done in post as well. Thank you. 